Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot. I'm here to do a reading for Capricorn. This is for Capricorn Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. And this is for the week of December 21st through the 27th. So the timing is still fluid. And not every reading is for you. So take what resonates, leave the rest. If you celebrate Christmas, Merry Christmas. If you celebrate the winter solstice, happy winter solstice. So let's get started. Well, what do we have for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? December 21st through the 27th. What should they expect this week? Balance, justice, karma. Boy, you're getting it like crazy. Huh? This is the justice card. So... This is about justice, karma, everything turning out as it should. A fair and just decision being made. Um, balancing of the scales. Be honest and upfront in any circumstances that you're dealing with this week. There could be news of legalities. Okay, you could also be dealing with a Libra, Libra or a Scorpio, because I think Scorpio got this, or maybe it was Sagittarius. I think it was Sagittarius. I can't remember. Anyhow, this is a Libra. So you could be dealing with a law. You could be dealing with with karma. Okay. I feel like there's two sides to every situation and karma sees through everything. So some sort of justice is going to be served. However, that resonates with you. Okay. Um, you're, the need for you is to be honest and upfront because everything is going to turn out as it should okay so this is the laws of karma in full effect this week trying to restore balance okay truth truth the truth coming out truth being told justice being served either good or bad because there's two sides there's a good side and a bad side you think about court when you go to court somebody wins somebody loses so it's all about integrity so justice is about integrity if you've acted with integrity then you don't have anything to worry about so what do we have for Capricorn there's one I think we'll go with those. Bouquet. Compliments from an admirer. So you're probably going to be getting some compliments this week. Goldfish. Increase in material wealth or spiritual growth. Now isn't that wonderful? So there's going to be an increase. An increase of wealth or growth. You're going to be getting some compliments from an admirer. So far, it looks good. So what do we have for Capricorn? Everything is going to turn out as it should. What do we have for Capricorn? Some sort of truth is coming that is going to bring balance. It's going to balance out the scales in some way. Definitely there could be uh, news, you know, uh, King of Swords, this is, could be the law, okay? I don't know, there's some sort of facts, okay? This is the cold, hard facts, the cold, hard truth. So... Uh, discernment challenging information you may be receiving some challenging information this week okay this is somebody I don't know if it's you or somebody that you're dealing with that is very stern to the point very factual has made some sort of decision okay um, I feel like there's going to be a conversation okay and I don't know if it's from a father figure or from a person in authority this could be a person that is in a position of authority that is, is giving you, uh, I don't know, it doesn't look like it's good. This person looks like they're upset or they're delivering a hard, uh, I don't know if it's a consequence. It could be a consequence, but it's the truth. Okay, this is, that sword cuts. 
okay it cuts and it, it feels like this is a a difficult decision you know there's a decision that is being made that may uh, it may not be what you want to hear but it's maybe it's for your highest good I'm not I'm not sure but with the king of swords this is challenging information that is coming could be from a, the, a judge or somebody in you know works for the law you know this is a, a law official or something like that doesn't have to be whoever this person is they are professional at whatever they do and they have some sort of information that um, probably they don't want to give that information but they have to you know what I mean it's difficult it's it's a, and this is a difficult decision and this is a decision as well I'm not sure if somebody is gonna be end up in court it could be going to court. You're going to need to keep your cool. Ooh. Eee. So interesting. Yeah, you're going to need... I think you are up against some somebody. You got somebody that is... I mean, we got you and we got somebody else, okay? So we, we, uh, somebody is going to be giving you some information. And, and maybe it could be good with the King of Pentacles because it looks to me as though, you know, you have some sort of stable opportunity in your hand, a stable offer, stability, okay? That, the King of Pentacles is stable, okay? So you have something of value, Now this is information. This is something valuable. So this is speaking. So somebody that is going, you're going to be speaking with somebody. You are. You're going to be speaking with somebody. You may be questioned about something. About somebody, some, I don't know if somebody's broken the law or what. You may be questioned. It feels like there's questioning going on. You're going to need to um, be practical, be realistic. I think you're up against somebody that is very, uh, it feels like they're, they're, they're hard. You know, this person is uncaring. They don't care about your feelings, so be prepared for that. This person may have their own agenda. The King of Pentacles. This is stable, solid, secure, hardworking, loyal, dependable. We have two people here. That's for damn sure. You may not see this coming. You may not see this coming. It feels like you're, you may be focusing on something else, you know? You may not see it coming. Trying to hold on to your stability. Maybe you're working, you're not, you're not seeing something. Hmm. Messages. Yes, there's gonna, things are gonna change really, really fast. This is fast forward movement. Messages, texting, emails. Um, yeah, it's texting, emails, letters, I'm not sure. There's some sort of information that is coming out. If there's been, there's something to do with messaging. You're going to be reading a message by the looks of things or reading messages or there's been some messages going back and forth. Somebody may ask for those messages. There could even be somebody that is investigating. There could be some sort of investigation going on. And it feels like it's behind the scenes because it's behind you. It's like you, I'm not sure that you see it happening. You may be too focused on your, your money or getting money or something like that. You're too focused on something else. But this is material wealth or spiritual gain. It's an increase. Some of you could be getting a job or getting something from somebody. The decision is definitely being made. I feel like it's being made in your favor. You may get some news. I feel like it's good news. I do. 
This may have to do with a contract because justice is about a contract and the king of swords is about a contract. So somebody is making a decision. It probably has something to do with a contract. I really feel like it's good news. But although this person doesn't look very, you know, they don't look very happy. I don't know why. Ooh, wow. Amazing. I mean, you don't see this very often. Okay, we got three kings. So we have people that are getting together and they're discussing, they're discussing your, I don't know, qualifications perhaps. So I feel like there's a there's a big decision that is being this is a big decision. Justice is a is a decision. It's like where you're at that court and a decision of your fate is being decided, right? Now this is this this is somebody that is emotional, feeling, generous, kind. Um so I do feel like there's a group of people that are probably talking about you. Okay, we probably got one person that is all about facts, one pe person that is very caring, and one person is is more about the money. Okay, I feel like you are going to get an offer. You're going to get something that you've been waiting for, some sort of approval or acceptance or oh, whatever it is. It's it feels like it's a, a big, huge opportunity. I mean, the Ace of Pentacles here. The Ace of Pentacles is abundance, it's prosperity, it's a new business, a new job, a new home. You know, whatever this does, it leads to financial stability. It's like you, it feels like you, are you ready? Are you ready for this? Are you ready for this? So I, I hope this is what you're, I hope this is what's going to happen. You're definitely going to be getting an offer, okay? You're going to be getting an offer and I feel like you're going to be happy with the offer. I do. Um... This is heart and mind, which is interesting. So there's there's emotions, there's facts, and there's stability. So it's interesting. It's very, very interesting. <laughs> what is this King of Cups? This King of Cups is a person that has good intentions, that wants to give you something. This is somebody that is intuitive and it feels like this intuitive person feels like you can handle it. Whatever this is, it feels like you can handle it. But it feels like there, there's another person here that may be a little iffy, but is willing to give it a chance. So that's interesting. Um, we have somebody here that has a really big heart with the king of cups this person has a big heart um, they know what they want somebody knows what they want looks like they're looking at you you know I feel like they see they see something valuable in you there's something that you have that they want or, or that they see as an asset okay Ooh, holy moly so this is a lot of people here. There's a lot of people. Um, I think that, uh, let me just see, Ten of Swords. For some of you, I'm changing the story. There's thousands of people watching this. Some of you may be receiving some news that something is over because another woman, maybe this other woman has decided to has many options we have a woman here that obviously has many options may have chosen because this is a choice another option so you may receive that news that could make you upset i mean these could all the all of these could be you all of these people could be you okay so we do have a very strong capable determined individual here who uh this is a force to be reckoned with. I mean, the Queen of Wands is a force to be reckoned with. This is somebody who is very, very knowledgeable, hardworking, dependable. But this is an ending. So we do have an ending here. I feel like you are going, it feels like you have an opportunity, a long-term stability, an opportunity for long-term stability. I feel like you have 
it's like you created it. It's, it's a creation. It is. So if you may have created yourself something really, really, really good. Very interesting. But ten of the end of suffering. This is the end of suffering. You may have been in a place of suffering, but it's over. This this place that where you've been, it's over. Your your confidence is gonna come back. Your determination, your willpower. It feels like you're you're making a turnaround. You're gonna your health is gonna start improving. I've, if you are a and this, this could go either way, male or female, there's multiple people that are that are interested. Whether you're male or female, you have multiple options here. You're probably gonna be receiving messages or offers from all different kinds of directions. And it doesn't have to be love offers. Whatever this is, you're gonna be receiving it feels like you're gonna be receiving lots of opportunity here coming soon. We have a very uh well, this is a, I mean, the, the Queen of Wands, and whether it's a you or it's, whether it's a male or a female or whoever it is, this is a very attractive person. Somebody, we have we have a very attractive person here that has, uh, or a very attractive offer as well. Anyway, we have an attractive person here that has many uh, people that are interested. So. I don't know. I don't know if this who if this is you or somebody that you're dealing with, but there's a there's a lot of interest here. Somebody is interested interested in one person. So we have one person that has at least three people that are interested in communicating, maybe signing a contract or doing something. Okay, there's there is there's something going on here for sure. Um, this is the end of suffering because that's what the Ten of Swords is. Somebody uh, has been in a very low place. They may have been, you know, felt like they were dead or a near death. You know, they may have felt like they were, you know, so they weren't going to survive a situation. But I feel like things are about to change for you. I do. I feel like things are about to change. I feel like you're going to be getting a very attractive offer from somebody that sees your value, however that resonates with you. Um, and you may have, you may be getting many offers. Okay. Maybe one offer. It could be several offers. It's almost like, it feels almost like you planted some seeds and now they're coming to fruition. And I don't even have that card. I just feel very strongly about it. Um, I don't know if there's a legal contract. It could be a work contract or any kind of legal contract. You may be signing a contract. Um, And now this could be like in 10 days from now, um, from this week, you know, from the whatever. Um, this is the end of suffering. It is the end of suffering. It is. <laughs> I feel like you have a very optimistic friendly person that sees something that it, a value in you okay this person is being very optimistic and they they feel they feel like they can trust you in some way ooh the lovers reversed, so that's a, that's the, that's a separation of some sort. Like, and it's funny because earlier I had to tell you somebody could be receiving some news, because this is news about the end of a contract. Okay, there could be a detachment because there's another option. There could because could, this could be the end of a contract, but there's another option because you see these arrows are pointing up at the justice card, and that's another contract. So. There's, there's definitely a choice that is being made this week that may move you in a new direction because this is a new direction. I think that you are going to be moving in a new direction towards getting what you deserve, but it may require you experiencing, you know, this is a loss. Okay. The 10 of swords is a loss. Okay. It is. It's the death of a situation. And it does have to do with a contract that probably isn't meant to be. So you may be moving away from a false contract. Okay, I'm just being honest with you. 
So I think that's what's happening. And I think you've been suffering. You've been in some sort of pain. But now you've got this new vision. You've got this new drive. You've got this new ambition. Something really good is happening for you. Trust me. I feel like you're going to have to make a decision. Maybe that King of Swords could be your energy. You know, you, and this is be honest, be upfront. Do the right thing. Do the right thing for everybody involved. You're going to be given an option, op options by the looks of things. I think you're going to be given options and you're, you're going to, you have a chance for an increase in whatever it is that you're looking for. Okay. This is spiritual growth and this is material wealth. That's an increase in material wealth or spiritual growth or both because there's this, it could be both. So I, I, I do feel like you're going to be getting an offer that really makes you feel good. Okay. Because of that queen of wands and the upright, it's really going to make you, you know, feel proud of yourself. You have a lot to be proud of. Um, but it does require some sort of separation because if it didn't, this card wouldn't be here. Okay, this is a disconnection, a detachment, a separation uh, from something that probably caused you a lot of pain. Maybe maybe brought you down. You know, you're separating. And it, I don't know who this person is. You're separating from somebody. And I think that you're, you are, you're moving towards something more balanced. Okay, this is balanced. More in line with your um, integrity, in line with who you are. So I, I see you moving. You're moving towards something um, more in, align, in alignment with you. Okay. Um, it's definitely the end of a contract. It's the end of a contract. You may receive news that also that somebody has moved on. Okay. You may receive news that somebody else, maybe it's your old contract has moved on. Maybe they've been proposed to, you know. Maybe there's been some sort of proposal or something. And that could make you upset. I don't know. Um, golden opportunity to go down a new path. You're going to, you're, you've manifested something. You're going to be getting something that you asked for. You asked for this. This is a new job, new money, good health, financial stability, financial security. Somebody is giving you something that you asked for. And I feel like you're going to be signing a contract because of it. I just, I don't know where the contract is coming from right here. An agreement of some sort. Somebody sees something in you and you're going to be getting an offer or an acceptance could be acceptance with that Ace of Pentacles. This is an opportunity for long-term stability. It could have something to do with a bank. Okay, this take it to the bank. Could be you. It could also be something to do with a home. Um, there, you could be there. The bank could be getting involved. However, that resonates with you. Somebody is going down a new path towards stability. They're going to be getting an offer that makes them extremely happy. No doubt about it. Six of Pentacles on the bottom. This is a, this is like an increase in money or a gift. Something or a new job or something like that. There's definitely receiving something that is emotionally fulfilling. Get prepared to receive something that you deserve. Now this can be give or take and I hate and there's two sides to every situation. So for if you have not acted with integrity and I, I have to say this, you may lose something. Okay, you, you may because this is give or take. It, it could be a profit or a loss. Somebody could lose something. 
I'm just being honest. It looks really good though because I see somebody heading down the path to stability and security. So be prepared to receive some sort of information that moves you down a new path. You could be heading towards a Libra. You could be heading towards anybody. Um, we have Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. We have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We have Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. And we have Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Either way, somebody is accepting an opportunity that they are being offered. And they should be proud. They should be really, really proud of what they have done to get it. When you think about the King of Pentacles, that's hard work paying off. So somebody's hard work is paying off. We have somebody here that is going, if you're not financially stable, financial stability is coming. You may be receiving an offer this week that uh, from somebody that feels like you have the drive and the desire and the skills to do it, whatever it is. You are determined to succeed and because that determination is going to bring you a gift of some sort if that's what you deserve, which I feel like you do because this looks very good. This does look very good. This is the end of a of uh well, it's the end of something because of that ten of swords, the end of suffering. I think that you have reached a place where uh, you know, that's a near death experience. And you may have reached a point where, you know, you thought it was never going to happen. But this is freedom. It's liberation. So now you're free. It's over. It's over. It's almost like the struggle is over. But it comes after some sort of separation. It does. That card not wouldn't be here. So be prepared to make a choice to let go of somebody. To let go of somebody or some contract that just isn't meant to be. So yeah, I feel like I feel like you're gonna receive some uh, triumphant news that you've been waiting for. Good luck.